Bob and Tom Tonight, starring Chick McGee, Christy Lee, Josh Arnold, and Tom Griswold. And now, here's Tom. Welcome back to the Bob and Tom Show. I'll take attendance here. Ace Cosby Engineer. Here. Chick McGee Sports Guy. How about ya? Occupier of the I Hate Steven Singer.com sidekick chair, Josh Arnold. Hey! Occupier of the uh, Navy Federal Credit Union Newsroom. Present. Thank you very much. It's Christy Lee. And uh, Willie G is over there. Willie. Hey! Good to see you. And uh, Patty G. Uh, Missing in action. Apparently, <laughs> September just not his thing. No. No. Not I'm a fan. Very upset, though, because I wanted to do the Gardner Minshew song sure today. Sure, you did. Um. He had one of the great games of all time. What do you hear? Wait, 19 for 20. Wait, oh, well, I was one of the say, great games of all time, wait, he said. Wait till you hear his <laughs> stats. Yeah. They were, the stats were really impressive. And, uh, I just, Amazing uh, game. I can't think of a better quarterback performance. <laughs> we, <laughs> we, the we, great uh, games of all time. Once again, this is all the Washington football team syndrome. Will yeah. we get used to it? Yeah. Oh, sorry about that. In any event, yeah, we'll have to do the song when he gets back. I, I think he's having some ear issues today. Uh -huh. uh, Chick McGee, once again, is at his <laughs> post. He's having some ear issues. He just doesn't want to hear it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and I, for one, don't blame him. Uh, Major League Baseball uh, yesterday, Chicago Cubs right-hander Alec Mills uh, twirled uh, on, uh, the second no-hitter in Major League Baseball this season. Just his 15th career start. 12 nothing romp over the Milwaukee Brewers. Now, let's get to the NFL. Cam Newton rushed for two touchdowns. Patriots hold on to beat the Dolphins 21-11. Newton rushed for 15 times, 75 yards, and threw for 155 yards. And also, uh, at the post-game press conference, he was uh, all decked out in his... Um, Bright canary yellow suit. The Roger Rabbit look, as I, I call it. Uh, yeah, it, it was very colorful. Point? Yeah, Very odd. It's, it's almost, what's the movie, uh, Jim Carrey... The mask, oh, the, the mask, mask. the yeah. suit, suit Could thing. I see that again, Chick? That too, yeah. Right. Is, uh, oh my! But Whoa. what a great game he had. Ah, he certainly did. Had to, that had to feel great. For and him. Uh, during, uh, at the end of the game, as uh, as happens with Mr. Newton, Rootin' Tootin, Cam Newton, uh, he was uh, approached by some of the Dolphins players who took exception to how Cam might have been celebrating, and Cam said they were trying to take his chains. They couldn't get their hands on my chains, so that kind of pissed me off. He said after the game. Don't don't try to grab my chains. Yeah. Cam said. No, nobody wants that. I didn't know you were allowed to wear actual that that complicated jewelry during an NFL. <laughs> Me neither. Well, yeah, there's a that no seems... there's a no dookie rope right. rule. There. there it is. That's what I was looking <laughs> yes. for. Yeah. Uh, uh, I knew complicated rope. jewelry would be. I think turned into something. You know what? That's, it's like the horse collar tackle. If you grab the dookie rope and pull on it, <laughs> I think it's the same thing with hair. Like I think whatever you can grab, you can grab, and so uh, your hair, like the dreadlocks and things, yeah, that's uh, that's legal. It's part. It's that's part of the all uniform. I would do if I were a part of the player. uniform. Yank them down by the hair. Well, you would make my a, opponents a great defensive back, right? You've admitted that uh, it's up to you to knock the guy down if he's going to catch it, right? Yes. No pass. There's no such thing as pass interference. He was about to catch the ball. I tackled him. <laughs> so a couple of interesting Interesting pass interference calls yesterday. <laughs> yeah, I did too, actually. They were. Uh, Tom Brady intercepted twice in his Buccaneer debut, 34 23 loss to the Saints, and head coach Bruce Arians said they were Tom's fault. Some uh, different approach by head coach. I hear that a lot. <laughs> Tom's fault. It's pretty much my life. Uh, second, uh, first pick led to Kamara, uh, Kamara's touchdown. Come on. And the second pick uh, thrown. Uh, 36 yards for a pick six by Janoris Jenkins. Is it Kamara or Kamara? I hear both. Uh. Thank you, Mr. President. Um, how is it spelled? K-A-M-A-R-A. Kamara. -A -A. It is Kamara. Alvin Kamara. Well, there's that song about his wife. Oh. Kamara Eileen. I liked, I liked the... You did? I like the stretch. I mean, it's... Why would he and his wife have the same first name? It, it makes zero sense. It's an unusual tradition. <laughs> in, uh, uh, the Byzantine... Uh, sure. They like to... Uh, sure. They, well, they, they name daughters after the mother, right? Don't they? Is that a junior? Uh, I don't uh, think so. No? Like Christy Jr.? Or That's something? really no, I've rare. I've never heard that. Yeah. Is that... Isn't Nancy Sinatra a junior? I don't know if they do that or not. So. They put the junior. Really? Nancy's their mom. I know that. Oh, I've. Is that a, well, I'm, okay. I, I have no idea. 
Uh, last night, Sunday night football, the Los Angeles Rams opened their new stadium with a win. Malcolm Brown rushed for 79 yards, two scores, 20 to 17 win over the Cowboys. Ah, oh, that's such a shame. Uh, DeAndre Hopkins, <laughs> a career high, 14 catches, 151 yards, yes, Arizona. Hopkins, Hopkins. Yes, <laughs> DeAndre Hopkins. Yes. He's the mayor of Badger's Drift. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's a small town. It's all such great names. Just take a left at very, Notting very Hill. Poetic. Uh, Arizona and, and uh, the card, their 24 20 win over the card, oh, over the uh, 49ers yesterday, and the petulant child why'd, is Kyle Shanahan. Why'd you keep saying card? What are you doing? Cardinals, Arizona card. I don't know. <laughs> Heisman winner Joe Burrow. <laughs> Ran for 23 yards untouched for a touchdown in his NFL debut. The Bengals, though, beaten by the Chargers or their place kicker, 16 to 13. <laughs> um, Joey Bosa and Melvin Ingram the third held the uh, Burrow to a 23 of 36, 192 yards and three sacks. Bosa. Bo Bosa, these nuts. Bosa. <laughs> That's how you do it. Uh, Lamar Jackson and the Ravens. Boy, this one got away from me. Uh, they went 38-6 to six over Cleveland. I, that sounds I like a kid's book, doesn't it? Lamar Jackson and the Ravens? <laughs> <laughs> kind of like a Percy... Uh, Percy and the... Whatever the hell. What is that? <laughs> Cleveland plus nine. I needed... Cleveland plus 33 to get that one. <laughs> uh, the shoe in of the week. Uh, so what was the final score? 38-9. Uh, to nine. Wow. God, yeah. this is getting tough. So <laughs> Anyway, a one in four. My neighbor is a huge win. Browns fan. Oh, I yeah? Man. Your neighbor, huh? Yeah, I hope they don't find him hanging from the rafters in the basement. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that would be a bummer. He's what is that. wrong with <laughs> this saying is this guy lives in... Breathe. That could totally happen. Why are you doing this? Like I said, I hope it doesn't. Uh, Packers <laughs> uh, beat the Vikings and Kirk Cousins, 43-34. Uh, Jacksonville and Gardner Minshew beating the Colts yesterday, 27-20. Uh, Gardner Minshew, 19 out of 20. Wow. That's almost perfect. 173 yards and uh, no picks for... For the Bob and Tom player of the decade. We just love the song. And <laughs> I love hearing him talk. He's, he's got that beautiful lilt when he speaks. And he's always got some weird facial hair Wait thing half Hold going. You, you you love him. I, yeah. I think he's great. I, <laughs> yes. I you got a crush on him. It's yeah, nice. It's all right. Yeah, 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 you're allowed. Speaking of Gardner, Men Gardner Minshew. Yes. There. yes. Um, I know that you're sad because he had a big day yesterday. <sighs> and... Yeah. Uh, Normally, Pat Godwin would be here to sing the Gardner Minshew song. Oh, right. But well, the Consensuals and I oh, were Lord. talking, and we've decided maybe there's a version that can be done today. Oh, okay, oh, now, uh, nice. now, once again, Gardner Minshew, great game, 19 for 20. Uh, they beat the Colts, the Jags, and... 27-20. Uh, I'm, I'm very excited. To, and late, I'll just, without any further ado, here we go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we couldn't let you go a day without, without hearing it, Tommy. But yeah. Well, Pat Godwin isn't here Claims there's trouble with his ear Pat, we miss you <laughs> oh. But the show, it must go on And we need to hear that song Gardner Minshew <laughs> This parody song stuff Really doesn't look too tough To just say Gardner Minshew <laughs> Gardner Minshew <laughs> So let's kill a little time while I find some words that rhyme with Gardner Minshew. Uh, uh, da 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 do 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 d. Something here that rhymes with d. Gardner Minshew. Yeah. Oh wow. Woo. Yes. Little uh. That Incredible. way you didn't. Uh, yeah. Leave empty. Josh Arnold and the Consensuals, it. ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. The Consensuals didn't have a lot of vocalization, did they? No, no. I asked them to stick strictly to the instruments this I, time. I see. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. They were you, just fellas. moving rhythmically behind. Okay, very, it. very good. Uh, see. The we Gardner Minshew tribute. I'm hoping that Pat will be here tomorrow. We can get the uh, the genuine article. Oh, that wasn't. Uh, <laughs> Oh, I loved it, Josh. Proper, Don't um, listen to Very nice. You did that was great. Josh, the only thing I was going to say is that I'm mad that I couldn't see it from the front because I know <laughs> there was some magic going on oh, with those yeah. fingers and those... I mean, you just reek of show choir, man. You, <laughs> can, really does. you can entertain. Yeah. Uh, thank you. I'm a showman, yeah. Oh, and I just got a text from Pat Godwin. Oh, my. What? This is a faint praise, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> ha. <laughs> H-A, he says. That's okay, it. Now, huh? wait a second. Now, is it capital H, then exclamation point? No, capital no, H, lowercase a, nothing. Oh, he's furious. You no, guys, no, no, that, that's like a B. If you get capital H, 
small a exclamation point, it's an A. A plus is capital H, capital A, exclamation, exclamation point. Mm. Yeah. That's how oh, that's, yeah. that's, that's what's I don't code. think, no, I don't think th that's yeah, right. Yeah, I don't think so. I think he was just letting you know that he heard your attempt. Which yep. is good news. <laughs> I don't wow. think, that is just cold. Yeah, I don't, I don't it, think It's good news that Pat could hear it. Oh right? my gosh, yeah. look at this now. I got a second text. Yes. Oh. At capital H, lowercase a, no less than five exclamation points. Oh, and wow. then... Very funny, like a good eight exclamation points. Huh. Nice. Did never Jimmy like it? Never put more than one. <laughs> Let me write back here. Go. Did <laughs> 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 you hear what Jess said? Now, uh, Jess Hooker is here with us. Jess, Jimmy, send us. <laughs> Jess, did you know that I have driven the Wienermobile? No. Oh, it's super cool. Is that a euphemism? Yeah, uh, yeah I didn't know how to take it. Oh, God. Parked yes. it in the garage, did you? Yes. You like yes. to see Tom drive the Wiener Mobile? Yes, I took <laughs> Park the, it in your first, garage. They've got their boat, and I drove Am it into Hare Harbor. Are you happy now? <laughs> oh, I am. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, I was trying to think of the other 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 vehicles like this, and I'm uh, I'm coming up short. The chicken mobile, that was a big one. Oh, there's um, a chicken car. Yeah, That's there's true. a chicken car. Chick is showing us some pictures. There's a goldfish truck and something that I am unaware of that I I'm a so Pepperidge, happy. Pepperidge Farm goldfish. There truck. is a Cadbury cream egg car that looks just like a giant oh, Cadbury nice. cream. I've wow. seen that. I love. We've got to get these all together. Yes, we do. Now, oh. when I drove the Wiener Mobile, by the way, it's um the transmission, oh. of course, the Wiener Mobile automatic. Yeah. The uh, corn dog mobile, of course, is a stick. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I had a mouthful of coffee, otherwise I would have. Oh, uh, so I deserved a little something. <laughs> now, uh, uh, Christy, could you go back to your story? I don't know, if, uh, My uh, Jess. God. I don't know what your. Um, we had a little bit of a discussion about candy. Okay. Um, and and that the neighborhood pool this weekend. We were all talking about what are we going to do for Halloween? Right. L.A. has already canceled Halloween. Mm -hmm. I think they're backtracking on that now, if you oh, look. They yeah. yeah, they're mm -hmm. saying that they uh, advise against it. Yes. They're there not, has to they're be not a way canceling. To, there has to be a way to do this properly. But um, we got, I think there, we'll the, be okay if we don't have a trick-or-treat. I What's think wrong that'd with be you? all right. Says the grump no. of the neighborhood. Yes. yes. I don't. I think what we're going to do is take the candies and <laughs> put gloves on and put them in baggies and <laughs> give me, give me, give put them on a table or something. Yes, I don't the candy's There's wrapped. There's got to be a way that, yeah, the, it's wrapped. that it can yeah. be properly yes. done. So you can approach the combat. Not handing out sliced <laughs> apples. <laughs> you do. You hand out sli You hand out something healthy. No, no I You're don't. not coughing on the apples and handing them to kids. You're it's pencil man, aren't you? You give out pencil. I am not pencil man. I am full-size candy bar guy man. I bet your mom and dad gave out pennies, didn't they? They seem like penny people. <laughs> oh, I bet they did. Here's a nice shiny nickel. Totally yeah. false. Oh, um, a nickel back then? Yeah. It was $30 Yes, now. of course, yeah. Like nine yeah, cents. Yeah, yes, we're talking before they put any of the contemporary presidents <laughs> on the coins. <laughs> <laughs> the front still, of the nickel said TBD. Hey, well, I'm I, it's the British, British I hierarchy. That, uh, they finally given the okay for Teddy Roosevelt. <laughs> Be on the money. I, I, no, he gave away decent candy bars. The reason I bring this up, if you'll let me get to this, yes. Jess Hooker, um, yes. we Going around, yeah, we, it's we, Jess's fault. No, we've gone around the room, and everyone has pretty much said they don't care for Peeps. Yeah, Peeps will not be in production mm. until Easter. I love Peeps. Oh, okay. Really? See, they've they got yeah. their loyal and following. Now, okay, and that's, I'm, I'm glad you said that. I want to read. I have three separate emails, and all are about the same topic. This first one comes to us from Luke. He writes, my mother-in-law loves Peeps. She opens the package and lets them sit on the counter for two weeks till they get rock hard. Yep. Oh. Yeah. Then she eats them. That's I've heard that too. From oh. Adam. We open Peeps, let them sit for three days, and then eat them. Ugh. But I admit oh. I'm a banjo guy, so maybe I'm in the minority. <laughs> Thank you. I'm a banjo guy, so yeah. Um, oh, you got a banjo, Josh? Uh, <laughs> I heard about that. Megan writes, uh, I love stale peeps. We okay. would leave them in the cabinet for a year after cutting the hole in them. A oh. year? A year. A year. Well, we have 10 year old We peeps like them like window. cement. Yeah, and covered in silverfish. Uh, <sighs> I, um, I dare you to eat one of those, Josh. <laughs> what? No, I wouldn't they're eat in the window. I wouldn't eat one off the factory. <laughs> there's there's a stale peep here right now. Yeah, yeah, they're, yeah they're, they're like I've never had a stale peep. No, I like these, these are a decade old. They're old. They're ten years <laughs> so old. So they're, they're probably covered in 
in God dust knows and what. God yeah. knows who's been in this room. Probably the Spyro Keats from the you almost low lifes on the AM cramp up. Yeah, <laughs> they, they the low lifes from the AM sneak in. <laughs> oh, uh, AM low lifes. I want to see what real radio's <laughs> like. Oh. <laughs> you are so, see. This is why people don't like you. Don't you know care. that, right? This is why I, I don't, don't care. care. Speaking of sports, oh yeah. yeah. And I know we just ended sports, but I have a bulletin. Uh, you remember Los Angeles Clippers guard Lou Williams? He left the NBA bubble to take a strip club, infamous trip to a strip club sure, in July. Sure. Well, a and funeral now, first, and then he's a strip set club. to make well, money. He didn't he tell the team he was going to a funeral, so they let him out of the bubble, and then he ended up in a strip club. Well, we all well, grieve in different ways. And then you remember that. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, you grieve in your own way, I'll yeah. grieve in my uh, That they had chicken wings called Lemon Pepper Lou, named after Lou Williams. Lou. Um, and then the Clipper star shared screenshots of an email from a lawyer that shows that he ha <laughs> now has officially trademarked the name Lemon Pepper Lou. Ugh. Williams forced to quarantine in the NBA bubble for a 10-day period after he was spotted uh, at Magic City, the adult entertainment complex. And he said, y'all make jokes and t-shirts, but it's going to cost you. I own Lemon Pepper Lou now on his Instagram. <laughs> I wouldn't uh, want to get into the IPO of that. <laughs> no. Yeah, These seven t-shirts he sells. Doesn't that sound like an old 1920s singer? Yes. And that was the version of uh, We're in the Money by Lemon Pepper Lou. <laughs> <laughs> We're in the money. Now you owe him five bucks. There he is. <laughs> uh, I saw Lemon Pepper Lou over at the uh, Palladium the other night. Yeah. My goodness, what a show. Oh, he put on. I hear they're going to get electronic microphones pretty soon. <laughs> That's right. No more megaphones for that crooner. Wow. <laughs> crooner. Fresh oh, out of vaudeville. I sat. I sat. <laughs> I've been doing this a long time, both man and boy over here at the I sports said, desk. Never mind. Yeah. Uh, keep I talking, Jake. I never thought I'd say. <laughs> I never thought I'd say this sentence. Ready? Yeah. The Clippers reserve guard claims he was attending the strip club strictly to get wings following his grandfather's funeral. Yeah. <laughs> well, didn't we sign kind of, there was some quality control that needed to be tested there. He's got I, his name on him. He wants to make so. sure they're still being served yeah, properly. So his official nickname is what again? Lemon Pepper Lou. Okay. I ah, yes. uh, Originally, Lap Dance Lou. Uh, <laughs> yeah, old Lap Dance Lou's become Lemon Pepper Lou. My goodness. Well, this doesn't quite have the effect without the music, does it? No, not at all. <laughs> Honestly, I think Lou Williams, I think that he was just going to get chicken wings. Lou Williams doesn't need to go to a strip club for whatever no, I, he needs. I completely yeah, agree I with think you. So too. I'm sure he didn't mind that yeah. they were being served at the uh, Also, Magic very, City. Very skeptical. No, you say strip club. Magic City is sort of a cultural institution. You hear about it in a lot of rap songs. I don't think that he was just trying to go to a strip club because he needs to see. Lou Williams can see whatever he wants to see wherever he wants to go. Oh, well, Willie, he'd been in a bubble. He hasn't seen very much in a long time. I mean, okay, maybe, but I I, I don't know. I, I Maybe it does, maybe it's because I'm fatter than I'm horny, but I think that <laughs> he was really just going. That's wings. a t-shirt I'd buy. Fatter than a morning. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, with, uh, a woman or some chicken wings? What do you think? Historically, <laughs> chicken wings. And I'm, I'm intrigued by lemon pepper. That chicken wings like never good. tell me no. <laughs> <laughs> chicken wings win. And Josh, they're only flat half the time. <laughs> oh! oh. oh. Well. It was a flats and drums. Guys, I'm fatter than I'm horny. I'm not trying to be mean. It was a flats and drums joke. <laughs> Lap dance Lou. That should be a t-shirt. I'm fatter than I am horny. Mm -hmm. And the How About You shirt. We should uh, do all these. Okay, well, let's we'll roll them out. It. Okay. Um, <laughs> is and that sports? that's sports this time. I mean it. Wherever you go, whatever you do. I'll do. Okay, so, already did. So he's trademarked what again? Lemon Pepper Lou. Who's going to buy that? A lot of people. Really? Just in case. Yes. You can't use it now unless you pay Lou. Add to cart and send. All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> then you've got to explain to people what a, Christy! Yeah, it's a strip club thing. Right? Like, there will be no peeps this Halloween. Oh. Peeps production has been put on hold due to the coronavirus. Fine with me. According to PenLive.com, Just Born Quality Confections said it will not be producing the popular marshmallow sweets for not only Halloween, popular. but Christmas or Valentine's top, Day. Go ahead, Ned. Easter, and we got something. Top three, <laughs> production. Things, top three things to do with a peep. Oh, number one is number microwave. Number one, put it in the microwave. Right. Yep. Number two, set it on fire. Number three, throw it away. <laughs> there you go. Eating it is not in the top no. three. Those Eat. peeps in the back window by Ace have been there for how many years now? They've been there. Do you see? No. Other side. Over, here. Over, yeah. yeah. 
<laughs> They've been here 10 years? At ever? least. I think yeah. since we had the studio. Bill. They have? Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but the peeps, it's, it doesn't it say they're going to they're going to have them for Easter. That's the whole yes. thing they're manufacturing. They're gonna, yes. Limited production resumed in mid-May with protocols in place to protect employees. Production for the candies will be um, in full gear for the next Easter Peeps season. Peeps have their loyal fans, though. Oh, yes, they yeah. do. Oh, they got their own thing on HBO now, the Peep Show. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's very popular. Oh, it's on Cinemax. Come on. Oh, very sorry. popular. What do you got? You got Peeps. You got Circus Peanuts. Yep. Ugh. You got uh, Necco wafers, all the worst candies. Right. Candy oh. corn, black licorice. Can bla oh, yes. yes. All those. Not, not My good. My grandma loved her black licorice. Yeah, uh, I mean, there's a market for it. People love it. I mean, that sounds like a, killed her, sounds like a hip hop song. My I, grandma loved a black licorice. Grandma loved a black licorice. <laughs> then it shows a, a black Grandma get on that black licorice. Wait, really quick. You said you said that sounds like a hip hop song. What do you think hip hop is? <laughs> I just wanted to see if Josh and I were on the same page. It was black rather black. rather awkward. Of course you were. <laughs> I mean, in those times, she was, she was incredibly progressive. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> can we talk about anything else? No, uh, uh, chick. What about spicy? But what? Spicy, spicy candy, hot tamales. Nah. Mm. Same company. Bake, uh, Boston hot, baked beans. Hot no tamale good. is made by the same company that makes um, Peeps. Peeps, absolutely. They make um, all the sh oh. <laughs> they, all the all the crap candy. <laughs> Do it, say it, Josh. Get it out of there. All See, the, uh, some people close. enjoy it very much. All the shorthanded candy is what you were to say. Yeah. You cursed. You haven't cursed yet, have you? Oh, twice. Yeah, twice. Oh, yeah. Is there one I called Ike both. and Mike's or something? Mike and Ike's? Mike Those and okay. Ike's. What about um, eat some now, save some for later? I think eat you're some correct. Now, save some for later. <laughs> no, I, later. Uh, honestly, Christy, I think that's the other candy that they make at that factory. Ike, Ike and Mike's. Yeah. Those are no good. Aren't those licorice? Never yeah. had them in Yeah, my they're life. very licorice flavored. Anybody want to uh, yeah. take good on the Ike road? No thanks. Okay. No. I don't like Ike, that kind of thing. Yeah. yeah. Well, they make Put Mike own, and Ike in your mouth. They also make a punch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ike Turner. Oh. Uh, oh. Domestic <laughs> abuse. Okay. Oh, I was going on Eisenhower. <laughs> yeah, this is. Yeah, I was going well, Eisenhower. The, the Eisenhower Memorial is just opening, so. Tina doesn't do much, anything easy. <laughs> that'd be a much, much better joke and a lot safer. Well, also okay. speaking of Halloween, there Wait, was. So we're done with the people, the pulp. The people. The people. <laughs> the, people. <laughs> the people have spoken. <laughs> no, we're done with the peeps. They're not going to be out till Easter, so don't look for them. Okay, I'm just trying to find out the other candies that they make. Christy, I think you nailed it. They can't sell peeps and people can't eat them, can they? Hey, I know people that love them. Does, does yeah. that happen? Yep. I uh. used to eat the sort of sugary part and leave the marshmallow inside. <laughs> does that make sense? Yeah. You just skin them? <laughs> yeah. You skin the peep? Yeah. Okay, Josh, I thought this would be right up your alley, man. Come you on. like you're out in the woods? Oh, I, don't, I don't buffalo bill my candies. Oh, yeah, I'd get in there. Watch the entire show live or on demand with the Bob and Tom VIP All Access Pass. Listen live with the Bob and Tom app and make sure to visit BobandTomStore.com. Tune in next time for more Bob and Tom Tonight.